Hi everyone and welcome back to Queen G's Recipes and today I'm going to be showing you a holiday favorite which is my snickerdoodle cookies recipe. So delicious, very easy to make most definitely and the ingredients we'll be needing here are first of all we're going to be needing some cinnamon sugar which is what we are going to be rolling our cookies in. Here we have some regular sugar, some all-purpose flour, baking soda, cream of tartar, some salt, an egg, softened butter at room temperature, definitely needs to be at room temperature, and some vanilla extract. You also want to have a couple of cookie sheets lined with some parchment paper. You also want to have your oven preheating to 375 degrees Fahrenheit. And let's move on to making our snickerdoodles. Okay, so into our mixing bowl, we are going to add in our softened butter at room temperature and our sugar, and we are going to cream these two together. Okay, so this looks good, and now we are going to add in our vanilla extract and our egg, and give this a good mix. Okay, so just make sure you scrape down the sides and bottom of your bowl whenever you feel necessary, making sure that all your ingredients get mixed together very well. Okay. Okay, so this is perfect. Now what I'm going to do is with my dry ingredients, I'm just going to give them a little mix here. Okay, this is good, and we will add it into our other mixture here. Okay, this is great. So now we'll mix until well incorporated. Okay, so our dough is ready. Now what we're going to do is with a small ice cream scoop or with a tablespoon, two tablespoons, that is totally fine as well, we are going to roll out some dough balls and then we are going to roll them in the cinnamon sugar that we have prepared and we'll place them on our baking sheet. Okay, so once you have prepared your snickerdoodle cookies here, you want to place them into your preheated oven at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for about 12 minutes. So between 10 and 12 minutes or when you notice that the outer edges are a light golden brown. I'll let you know what mine look like when they're done. Okay, so my cookies were in the oven for exactly 12 minutes. 12 minutes is the perfect time to uh, bake these cookies. Now it does vary from oven to oven, so give or take one or two minutes. You don't want to over bake them or they won't have that nice chewy tender texture in the middle. So that's that. I just wanted to let you know one thing. Make sure when rolling your little dough balls in the cinnamon sugar that you coat them well so that you have that cinnamon sugar effect on the outer part of your cookie. So now I'm going to allow them to sit on my baking sheet probably for about five, seven minutes and then I'll place them on a cooling rack and we will be that closer to trying one. Okay, so our cookies are cooled and we are definitely ready to try one right now. I have one set aside here on a plate. I really have no words. They are just amazing. The centers are nice and tender. The outside has a nice light crunch. It is so good. Everything you would want in a snickerdoodle cookie for sure. And that's about it. It was so easy to put together and uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. So if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give us a nice big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and hit the notification bell so you will be notified every time I upload a new and delicious recipe. Share the recipe with your family and friends and I'll see you on my next video. Take care. Bye everyone.